yeah, let's just hop in there. I mean, last last part, in the first part, we essentially ended with like the Cylons are back. A bunch of our people got destroyed. We got Boomer out here in space, um, and everything's kind of going to hell, right? That's essentially where we left off. Um, got Starbuck getting some of the what I thought were like the museum ships. I don't know if I was right on that. Um, we got Homeboy who fucked everything up down here. And he might be dead, but I'm going to go with no, because the one girl seemed to, like the other one Cylon seemed to have protected him for some reason. And yeah, so let's hop in here. I mean, I think this is Boomer and the one dude. And uh, we're just going to kind of go through space and see what happens. Uh, yeah, so here we go. Including the colonies of Caprica, Pycon, Aralon, and Tauron. I feel like maybe we shouldn't have told anybody anything. Colonial Heavy 798. Where? What the fuck? What should we do? A missile? Copy that. But he can't even do nothing with that. He said he can't even fire with that bitch. Take it, have it follow it. Hammer said, because it's a homing missile. I thought he said he couldn't fire with this sign. I thought he said if it came to a battle. Well, that's probably why. Never mind. So, what is the per what is the reasoning for the Cylon attack? Just because I don't know, because they were like they were slaves or whatever to the humans back then or something. Hey, jackass. What's up? I mean, I'm calling him a jackass, but again, he didn't know she was a Cylon, but then again, he, he shouldn't be sharing that information with anybody. Giving people access to shit? Okay, you're gonna be a problem. I know Captain, that. Are you alright? Ladies in charge. Oh. I mean, she's seen. Oh, oh look, there we go. Okay, let's just settle down here. Settle down, and no one gets hurt. Oh, I gotta get on board. I'll give you fifty thousand. We're not taking. We're not taking money. This isn't a rescue ship. This is a military vessel, and we're not taking money. All right, all right, all right. I don't even see children. Children first. Children. Oh, there we go. Go ahead, baby. Go ahead. What? I'm not. What's happening here? Oh man, our team is out there just fighting. Miss. Watch it, watch it. Engines all ahead full. Alright, clear the tube, let's go! Get her in! Is she the best pilot they got? Oh, buddy. Hold it together, guys! Lasky, you've got an inbound nuke! All vipers, break, break, break! Grace for contact, my friend. I haven't heard that in a while. We've got structural buckling all along this line. We've got to get those fires out. I know. Fire suppressors are down. Water main is down. I'm trying to fight this fire with handheld gear. We've got another decompression heading toward the port pod. What are your orders, sir? My man doesn't know. He is. Sir. He is fucking useless right now. He, he, he is not prepared for any of this. Seal off everything forward of frame 30 and start an emergency vent of all compartments. Wait, what? Wait, I've got over 100 people trapped up behind frame 34. I just need a minute to get them out. If we don't seal it off now, we're going to lose a lot more than 100 men. Seal wow. it off now. I'm not doing that. You're going to have to fucking... All hands. Seal off. All bulkheads. 25 through 40. Are people just going to get sucked out into... Ticket number 47. Nice. Here. Could you come up here, please? Yeah, of course. Excuse me. Oh, he didn't, he didn't do her, her dirty. He was but thinking about it, though. Give me one reason why my better choice is one of the greatest minds of our time. Oh my god, you're giving an OBSC for this deck. This like this dude right here, man. I know you can. You've proven it. 
Oh my god, you're there too? You gotta be kidding me. Oh, he wasn't actually there, he's just seeing things. I mean, we couldn't do laps, I mean, kids, you know, some of the kids might not weigh that much, I mean. Oh shit, what the fuck are you doing, brother? Do now avow and affirm. Kind of like she's the designated Do now survivor. Avow and affirm. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my God. That was the guy that was helping her work on the, um, on the other ship. All I needed was 40 seconds. 85 of my... I got, got chills right there. Holy shit. <laughs> Munitions depot confirmed, but we have two problems. I know who you are. The Captain Apollo has a nice ring to it, don't you think? <laughs> okay. This spits. And now he'll get mad? Is this a joke? <clears throat> Is your ship all right? We're both fine. Thanks for asking. <laughs> and you're taking orders from a school teacher? Oh, shit. <laughs> we got trouble. Uh, stand by, Galactica. What? What is that? You mentioned what it was, but I'm not exactly sure what it does. The fuck did he do? He did the EMP, and I'm wondering if those things, like, the Cylons, they detect, like, life forms or something, and that's what they attack or something. So when he did the EMP, or not life form, maybe they attack engines, I don't know. Go find me some bullets, Chief. Right. Copy that, sir. All right, get your gear. Let's move out. Where are we going? We're at... Oh, we're on the station, okay. Okay? We no! We shoot Look, this motherfucker in the face. I don't have time to argue with you, so here's the deal. We've got over 2,000 people on that ship. Now, you think you can shoot every single one of us? Fine, but if not, get the hell out of my way! Have you considered the possibility that I can very well exist only in your head? Without being a hallucination? Maybe you see and hear me because while you were sleeping, I implanted a chip in your brain that transmits my image right into your conscious mind. What the hell? There's she no fucking me. way. Ducked on the other side of the station. Be careful! Don't stack him so high! Well, he wasn't stuck here. I don't get it. I'm very confused. Okay, those warheads over there. Hey! Be careful with that! Look out! Is there another way out of here? Yeah. What the fuck is this deal? Listen, uh, listen, we're gonna go out another way. Sir, I don't think that's a wise idea. You got your orders. Tell Colonel Ty he's in command until I return. Yes, sir. He looks sick, but what's wrong with him? She was traveling with her grandparents, but grandmother's having some health problems since the announcement. Not to worry, though. We're taking care of her. My parents are going to meet me at the spaceport in Caprica City. Spaceport. I see. We're going out for dinner, and I'm having chicken pie. And then we're going home, 
and then Daddy's gonna read to me, and then I'm going to bed. About time we caught a break. That brings us up to about what sixty shifts so far. Not bad for a few hours work. All right, guys. So I'm gonna end this here. Um, so the reason is, if you guys, some of you guys know, some of you guys don't, with Dropbox, once I hit the hour mark. The video is cut off if you aren't using the app or aren't watching it on a desktop. So if you're watching it on mobile or like a secondary kind of thing, when you click it, it'll just mess up and it won't play past this point, which is why I've, I always try to keep it under an, an, under an hour if I can. Um, I don't always succeed. I mean, right now we're over an hour. So anybody that can't watch this, the thing already cut off for them. So um, yeah, this is why, this is why I do it this way. It's why I don't like to go over an hour. So. Uh, but yeah, so we're going to hop out here. Um, very much am into this show so far. Like, really, really dig it. I'm going to try to get the other episode up as quickly as possible, not so that you guys don't have to wait another week. Um, I'll probably try to do it probably tonight, maybe tomorrow. Um, it'll be my attempt. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to get out of here, and I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this. See you guys later.